And now here is the stuff that I got from today. Uh, this is just the scorecard that I used. That's not really anything. Just finished filling that out, which is why it's still on the table. Uh, but the first thing here is a souvenir cup. Obviously, did have to buy it, but this is one of the coolest souvenir cups because it has all the Yankees World Series logos on it from years that they won. And uh, obviously not all of them as I look at it now, but some of them. And um, I guess it kind of ties in with something that I saw in the store where periodically over this year and I guess next year as well, they're going to New Era, the company that makes the hats for MLB and most other baseball caps. Uh, they are periodically over the next two years releasing special World Series hats from each of the 27 years of the Yankees and I saw a couple of them in the store today of course they were like $70 so couldn't get them exactly but um yeah this is this is the only thing that I, oh that I really got in the store um the baseball cards which really I only use for um autographs and stuff and actually in the stadium these were sold out in every single store so i couldn't find them but i did find a pack just like it uh, in a store across the street for eight dollars which is probably cheaper than in the stadium and one weird thing is one official souvenir stand outside this just outside the stadium there's still official yankee souvenir store or whatever they still had some but they turned everyone away saying they're close so I, I don't understand that this is a actually a 2017 version even though it has Jeter on the front but you see all the players on the back everyone is from 2017 and I guess Jeter is a special one for I guess people to buy it because he's on the very front um, anyway and the last thing is the biggest thing I haven't even unboxed this yet um, it is, oh, on message from phone, uh, Whitey Ford bobblehead day, uh, July 9th was today. Um, I guess they really tried getting people in for this whole series against Milwaukee because they've had a promotions for every single game this weekend, which is not very common, but it definitely worked today. It was almost sold out. Uh, just take a look at the box, and I guess this is quickly going to turn into an unboxing video here. Actually, that was pretty easy. Didn't have to really rip anything. We're going to have styrofoam all over the place. Sorry, I just need to... Well, um, that's awkward. I tried pulling it out from the bag and it just unwrapped it and it's still in there. Oh, this is going to be a mess. Yeah, I cannot grab this. Um, I'm actually going to bring over the trash can. Um, as you can see, it kind of made a mess everywhere. Um, yeah, I'll, I'll be back when I make some progress here. Okay, we have made some progress. Literally, all I did was just push up from the bottom and it seemed to have broken a little bit so you can actually get the whole block up instead of just ripping apart tiny pieces of styrofoam that won't get me anywhere. It's starting to slip down again. Okay, I think I got a firm grasp of it. And there we are. Uh, more plastic. And uh, there we are, the Whitey Ford bobblehead from today's game. Very nice, very nice. 
and uh, he was a pitcher. I believe he has the most wins for a starting pitcher in Yankees history. Um, 40s, 50s, and maybe a little bit of 60s he played. Um, after he was drafted, he was also drafted for the war, so he had to stop for a couple years. And uh, yeah, pretty cool. And uh, I don't know what this is. Oh, at and advertisement. Wonderful. Um, but yeah, that is pretty much it. Hope you guys enjoyed this. And uh, I will see you guys next time. And also, if anyone cares, let's do a quick unboxing of the trading cards. Okay, I just got it get it out of the plastic and there it is a lot simpler than the bobblehead okay so like I said all of these are 2017 except for Jeter which I guess is a little gimmick because they put them right in the front of the box just to sell it just a gimmick to sell it so there's Jeter stats we have Chase Headley we have Dellen Patances. Hey, how these are sideways. We have Brett Gardner. Upside down. We have Gary Sanchez. I need to learn how to turn these the right way. We have Aaron Judge. I'm good at flipping these. Uh, we have Starlin Castro. We have CC Sabathia. Oh my, I can't. No matter what I try, I can't do it. We have Jacoby Ellsbury. DD Gregorius. Greg Bird. Michael Pineda. Tyler Austin, who is injured at the moment. Luis Severino. Araldis Chapman. Matt Holliday, injured. And Masahiro Tanaka. And uh, that's that. So now I will definitely see you guys later.